One, two, one, two. On an evening in December, back in 1773, a band of Boston patriots did creep aboard an English merchant vessel loaded down with tea and dumped it in the briny deep to steep. Then to celebrate, they had a cup of tea. A cup of tea? I don't think so. Each one had himself a Samuel Adams. Pilsner is a patriotic drink. So bend an elbow for democracy. Chug for change until you're numb. Yes, we bottle, and yes, we can. It's the beer party and thumb. Ordinary folk, no brother's coke, no backroom dealing, common sense on tap, no corporate crap, and no Darjeeling. Then, after the election of Obama, there arose a group they called the Party of the Tea. Some taxophobic, xenophobic, homophobic schmoes who rode the crazy train to victory. Ultracon hysteria, that's their cup of tea. Their cup of tea? That's just psycho. Grab a Schlitzer, Butterbacher, Blitzer, any brew a patriot would like. Oh, bend an elbow for democracy. Chug for change until you're numb. Grab a pint and a progressive stand. Stand with patriots across this land. Land on your ass in the grassroots and bend an elbow for democracy. Chug for change until you're numb. Yes, we bottle and yes, we can. It's the beer party and thumb. Hops and change! <laughs>